Hello from Fanta BH again. New video and new uh, self build device. First to say sorry because no video for the last 15 days. Just simple. Was too busy with uh, real life obligations so couldn't get enough free time to record and uh, upload new video. Sorry about that. Um, this is fully self-built by my hands, uh, I think five years ago. It's, uh, I needed it. It is uh, maybe the best and the cheapest car battery charger, automatic car battery charger. This device, uh, I built this box fully by myself uh, used uh, material for this box is used from old computer case and just cut it and build it from that so it's very nice build it need to be strong because uh, inside this there is heavy transformer as well so let's open these Here we are with open device. This is heart of the device of charger. It's a transformer, powerful transformer, 600 watts transformer. I took it from old UPS, computer UPS. It's serving this charger very well. It does not heating too much. Well, on full power it do heat a little, but not more than 15 degrees Celsius, so it's okay. Uh, here down is a PCB board. This is cooler, only heat sink, not big one you need for a main thyristor. Silicon controller, direct fire. Uh, it's it's this one. You see. This one controlling all current going through this thyristor and supplying battery, charging battery. This circle here is controlling the gate of this main thyristor uh, it uh, switching on and off charging process at given states so you setting up on what point it's going to stop charging with this uh, regulated resistor actually trimmer in my case I using this little blue here it's a small trimmer, it's a multi-tour trimmer, so you can precisely set amount, precisely can set uh, when charger going to cut off charging. In my case I set it on 30.7 volts, it's enough, it's an over 90% charge, charged battery at that voltage so this one my charger will cut off charging and at 30.7 volts one led another led this one is uh, power led i mean not power led it's uh, it's usual five millimeter normal led but uh, it indicated indicating when device is uh, powered on and this one will light 
moderately when charging process is on when charger go off it start, start blinking this small thyristor it's as well silicon controlled rectifier but small one i put it on uh, on heating as well but it does it does not heating at all it controlling a uh, gate of this thyristor so it controlling when i already, already said when charger going to stop charging this circuit here it's 12 volt stabili stabilized 12 volt uh, supply for uh, uh, for uh, cooling fan and a rectifier here as well have a nice heatsink here so it does not sharing heat sink with main thyristor main thyristor have this one and here i don't know can you see let's zoom it a little okay now you can see here another copper heat sink for a rectifier main rectifier and as well in this corner here you can see here it's a 100 amperes bridge for a ampere meter that's all about how I built here we have battery I use it to power on my ampere meter and voltmeter as you can see it lasts for a about two years then it uh, it is empty i have to replace it but uh, i built this relay here built in i will take that out as well that is the relay i using it uh, to cut off power on instruments so they not does, uh, does not uh, discharge battery when i don't using charger i speed it up this part so until i don't replace battery with new power supply enjoy the music Time to test is uh, everything working just fine and to see condition of this battery how much it will take how much current it going to take from this charger when I connect it sorry I had to remove original sound from which was recorded during recording video because uh, cooling fan was so loud on uh, on camera microphone i don't know why uh, in reality we, i almost don't hear cooling fun so strange so here you was able to see 
how it works it start charging on high current and uh, dropping it down as uh, battery getting charged but this battery was uh, almost fully charged in good condition so it took uh, it took high current only for a few seconds before it started to drop down I suppose this battery in one or two hour uh, will trigger uh, automatic switch off of charger so that is all about this charger and below this video you will find all schematic uh, PCB layout and rest of things if you wanna try to build s something like this and now it's time to click subscribe button and subscribe to my channel uh, if you subscribe it will help me on many ways but if you don't like whatever if you have any comment just write it down i will do my best to answer on any, on every comment and thank you for watching and goodbye till next video